Hi guys! Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to press and dry a flower. So the materials you're going to need is a big stack of books, um, your flowers. I just went out into my garden or my backyard and picked some flowers and a piece of parchment paper. If you don't have parchment paper, paper towels work fine. And then basically all you're going to do is, I like to take the book in my stack that's um, the second to the bottom. So I'll take this book and I'll just open it up randomly, usually in the middle somewhere. So I have my book open and then what I'm going to do is take my parchment paper, fold it in half, make a nice crease, open it back up, and I'm gonna lay the flowers in there. When I put the flowers in there, I wanna make sure I have them, cause they're gonna get flat and pressed down. So I wanna make sure that I have them in a good position. So when they get flattened, they will look nice. I'll take my next ones. And I got a few little more. And then I will fold the parchment paper back over them. Give it a nice little pat. And then I will just close the book on it. And then I'll put this back where I had it. Second to bottom, stack the other books on top. Have a book on the bottom so it can be compressed nice. And then I usually wait about two weeks before I open it. Here's one that I did about three weeks ago. So I'm gonna open it up. And then it's pretty fragile, so just be careful with it. But then it is dry. All right, well have fun finding flowers and pressing and drying them. And you should share with us what you do with them. Thanks.